Hello, my name is Gabriela de Seta, Nie uh, Keijo wo Huzuge, and uh, I am a media anthropologist working in Taipei. I am an anthropologist, I have a social science background, uh, and I study media. I'm interested in media, mostly digital media. And um, I come from Italy, from Rome, uh, and I came to Taiwan uh, three years ago to, to work at the Academia Sinica. And uh, I worked here for two years, and then um, after that, I did some freelancing for roughly a year. I applied to do some three months of research about sound in Taipei because I'm quite interested in sound. One of the works that I'm preparing for the exhibition is an audiovisual work about sound objects in Taipei. I think it's a very uh, welcoming place and uh, it's, for me, it's in, in a very good area, geographical area, because uh, I do research on Chinese-speaking countries. Taiwan is, is very convenient. Uh, you can fly to many places in Asia and uh, it's, it's quite well integrated with the um, networks of academia and research and art, with all the things I'm interested in. Uh, and when I finished working, um, I didn't know that I could get an extension, so I had to search online and then ask, and finally I got this three months uh, extension, which was, I think, is, is a good program, but it's also not uh, enough to find a job in Taiwan, just three months uh, as a foreigner, if you, especially if you are in education. So when I found about the gold card, I was quite happy. For me, it was quite easy because in education, you just need to have a PhD from those universities. But from other category, categories like uh, arts, uh, you need to list all your works and to show that you have some recognition. And that might be more uh, challenging for people that maybe are not artists in a traditional sense. I think it helps uh, a lot, especially in my condition, because um, if you have a, a job, then it's kind of like a work visa, and it's easier to apply than a work visa. Uh, but in my case, as a freelancer, uh, someone who's kind of in between jobs and starting his career, uh, I think the gold card helps, uh, helps me in having a stability and a bit of safety, uh, knowing that I can work legally uh, in Taiwan, uh, that I can, I don't need to go in and out every three months, uh, and that I can rent a, a place, sign a contract that I have, uh, yeah. So it's, it's quite helpful um, in that sense.